Heart attack has been among the leading cause of death worldwide. How does it happen? Is it treatable? A heart attack, also known as a myocardial infarction, is a serious medical emergency that happens when the blood flow to the heart is blocked. A plaque buildup in the coronary arteries contains fat, cholesterol, and other substances. Then a piece of plaque breaks off, which can form a blood clot, blocking the flow of oxygen-rich blood to the heart muscle. The lack of oxygen can cause damage to the heart muscle, leading to the signs and symptoms of heart attacks. The symptoms of a heart attack can vary from person to person. Chest pain or discomfort, this is the most common symptom of a heart attack in both men and women. Shortness of breath, difficulty breathing or feeling short of breath can be another sign of a heart attack. Nausea or vomiting. Sweating, breaking out in a cold sweat or feeling clammy. Fatigue, feeling unusually tired or exhausted, especially in combination with other symptoms. Some people may have a silent heart attack with no symptoms at all. If left untreated, a heart attack can be fatal. You must seek medical attention as soon as possible if you suspect you or someone else is experiencing a heart attack. Treatment for a heart attack typically involves medications to dissolve the blood clot and restore blood flow to the heart. Every minute counts when treating a heart attack and minimizing damage to the heart. Now let's discuss angioplasty. This procedure is used to treat blocked or narrowed arteries. It involves using a thin, flexible tube called a catheter inserted into an artery through a small incision in the wrist or the groin. Once the catheter is in the blocked heart artery, a contrast agent is injected through the tube to help the cardiologist see the precise location of the blockage. Then a small balloon at the tip is inflated, which pushes against the walls of the artery and helps to widen the opening. This procedure restores blood circulation to the affected area in the heart muscles. In some cases, a stent or small metal mesh tube may also be placed in the artery to keep it open. The procedure is usually performed in a hospital or outpatient setting and takes about an hour to complete. Local anesthesia is used to numb the area and most patients can go home the same day. Recovery time after angioplasty varies, but most people can resume their normal activities within a few days. It is important to follow your doctor's instructions for aftercare, including taking prescribed medications and making lifestyle changes to prevent another blockage. One in every four deaths in the United States is due to heart disease, according to the World Health Organization, 2018. Please speak with your healthcare provider if you have any further questions about the procedure or would like to learn more about other treatments for blocked or narrowed arteries. Thank you for watching another video from Medical Arts Official. Subscribe and hit the bell button to get notified about our next release.